So it is 6.5 and our tra train, our plane leaves at 10. So we have so plenty we have of time. Yeah. <gasps> <laughs> I'm so a bit scared. <laughs> so we have plenty of time but she's worried that we're going to miss the plane. It's said, said to be there at 7 and it's quarter to 10 to 7 and we just set off. The, the, the check-in gate closes 90 minutes before departure. How many years has it been since you've gone to Pakistan? 15. She's in for a shock. I already told her that. A quite, culture shock. Quite scared. Not gonna lie. Also, she doesn't speak a word of Urdu or Punjabi. <laughs> not even a word. Not even a hanji. No, she could say hanji. She and wouldn't she, know. No, I think I will to like. And will you also say, say will you also say tikka and stuff like that? Probably no. Mine's mango and hers is some berry Red thing. berry smoothie. Yummers! Cute! So I've got my, um, my food first, perks of ordering a different meal. So should we just have a look at what I've got? So I've got some bread, cracker. I've got some carrot cube, salad. Mm, Yummers! <laughs> I'm gonna try and swap the cube for some chocolate mousse. We'll show you the non-veggie meal real soon. Real, real soon. <laughs> the movie's ending, so... <laughs> what are you watching? It's called Happy... Happy Death Day. Happy Death Day. It's quite good. Alina suggested it and it And um, we feel like we should be living the same day over and over again. It's the day she was it's her birthday and the day she gets killed. Can we just talk about this? That's how much water she gets. I drink about 17 times this much. <laughs> What's the purpose of the cracker? Yeah, but you butter it. But is there no cheese? Oh, wow. I got the chicken. Actually, I could eat that. Yeah, and the raisins are I'll just, just not in eat the middle. Them. Yeah, I'll just not eat those. And then I got some like rice things. Rice to start and rice for me. I got the cheese again. Yum. And then my dessert. Does it look nice? Yeah, look. Chalky tart. Tart. Ooh. My chicken brownie was actually really nice. I just left the chicken pieces because I'm not a huge meat eater, but my other flavour was really good, so I ate around the chicken. I'm about to have my crackers with cheese. She's already had hers. It worked out because Dad doesn't eat chocolate, and I had kiwi, so he can eat that. It looks weird, though. It's salted caramel on top. <laughs> Go on, taste it. It looks like... Taste it, because I haven't tried mine yet. Taste test. Look at an M over there. Wait, it's not focusing. Oh, how do I zoom there? Wait, come back. It's fancy. Ooh, are you drinking tomato juice? That's disgusting. <laughs> right, I went back to the taste test. This is like a five out of ten, I'd say. Really? Yeah. That's right. a bit disappointing. Right, I mean, I'm, I'm still gonna eat. I'm gonna try it. So, me and Ellen were asleep, and the juice cart came round. <laughs> And now we're woken up and we're thirsty. <laughs> she wants tomato juice again. With Worc Worcestershire sauce, however you say it. You're annoying. <laughs> so we are nearly there. I'm watching Blackish. Asma was watching Pitch Perfect too, but she fell asleep. I kind of woke her up by accident. I thought you were just on my feet. <laughs> <laughs> and then is over there talking to her father. He's not had the most comfortable journey. So we've just landed. Yeah. Everyone's legs. waiting. Legs stretching. Everyone's waiting to get out of the plane. I wish um, these cameras had filters like Snapchat, like filters. Snapchat filters. We've arrived in Dubai. 
and there's a two hour transit. So it's not that long because no. I think there's only an hour left now. Yeah, and we're just waiting for Dad to come after reading the mass. And then we're gonna board for Lahore and then a two hour drive to Faisalabad. How did you find it, Alina? I found it really long because Asma would have talked to me. She just watched, she legit, she watched a movie, three hour movie, and then just put the next one on, then put the next one on. What else are you supposed like, to do to on me. the flight? And like, then when we're about to land, she goes to sleep while the plane is landing. And then she starts recording me. So you might see it if Venom is gonna let you see it, but she doesn't edit it out. But we'll have to see. She might do like a quick glimpse. <laughs> <laughs> and a clip of Asma sleeping here. <laughs> and I'm sitting here. She took one for the team and sat with Dad. <laughs> yeah, he was alright. He was not bad. Yeah, okay, he's coming now. So bye. Hi guys. Seems like we don't meet much in my vlogs. We're on the plane to Faisalabad. No, Lahore now. And like, you know when you already get a glimpse of Pakistan when you're in the gate and then you realise it's really bad. Do you know what? This time I'm not looking forward to it that much because my mum's not with me and she wasn't that well and I felt so horrible leaving her. Like I kept saying I want to cancel my ticket and go with her because she's coming in like 10 days but she kept saying and I'm stopped saying that so then I stopped saying that but hopefully she's gonna feel better now she's feeling better already that's good savory mix Ooh, we're gonna eat now this is chicken smells good there we go I ate my rice left my chicken and um, did the same <laughs> I feel really bad for the chicken though it just wasn't I don't know, I feel a bit weird about eating meat. I had the bread with this achar, mango pickle. That was really yummy. Now I'm about to eat the gulab jamun. They've also got after meal digestive. What's this called again? Like, um, soft? Soft, yeah, that's what it is. Soft covered in sugar. Yeah, put it into there. Put your pickle into there and then I like made that into- I don't into like it when the food touches. Right. Oh, the food is touching, the food is touching. I think I'm gonna spread it. Right, that might get a lot. A lot of a jar. So guys, we have arrived in Lahore. And we're just chilling. And we're all a bit annoyed because we can't connect to Wi-Fi because to connect to Wi-Fi, they send you a message. And obviously we don't have a text to message. And home is two hours away. So I can't yeah. text my mom. So mom, if you're watching this, I've tried to contact you. <laughs> Oh, I miss my mom. I can't wait for her to come here. Oh my god, Baji, your ankle's so swollen. Oh, oh no, that's so sad. She had a bit of an injury, you see. Wow, it looks like Atta. It looks like Nanyama's when she's. Yeah. You can't, it looks very plem. Check out my dad's new car. Easy, Dad. Oh, this is like his dream car. So I'm so happy for him. I wish we could have had this car for our travels, but we have dad's. No, we have dad's leftovers. No. <laughs> Can you tell where I am by the way I look? I'm in Pakistan. These two chilling on the balcony. Oh my god, my eyes. I need to put sunglasses on. Oh, these flowers are so pretty. I want a picture there. Same, it's so cute. And those white ones. We're going to Gojra now. We've just left Faisalabad and Badji said, oh my god, dad, is it season for melons? And then he was like, yeah. And now he's stopped the car and got out straight away to get some because he's a cutie. And then next to him is dad's best friend. Real cutie. They're also related. Yeah, they're also related. And he lives in Amarika. South no. Amarika. No, it's no, in it's New York. York. Amarika, but I'm just going to see if people know. He lives in the, in the Bronx. We're going to Godra now, which is quite fun. Alina is in for another kind of surprise. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but I personally really like Godra because it's... Because it's very um, raw and unfiltered. Authentic. We are uh, in Faisalabad again. 
after visiting our family in Gaudra and now we're gonna do a little spot of shopping and then we're gonna head home maybe we can do a bit of shopping uh, vlogging because yeah. we don't usually get do to cover that the windscreen is really clean on them. Yeah. Wow. I've arrived at Cardiff. Oh my god, I got some really good chips from Hardee's the other time, last time we came here. I love this area, like the parking is so nice and roomy. Ooh, we are in our element. Oh, I like that. That's cute. Do you know what, like, these things are like triple the price in Westfield, Stratford. This one's so nice too. It's, it's sleeveless though, so... Oh, that one's very nice. And then the ready-made stuff. Oh my god, this is so cute and colourful. I love this. Want it. And they're so nice and willing to help here. I've tried this good down. How amazing is it? And then these... Good Garare are like they're really nice they're really expensive so I was like okay I'm definitely not gonna get them I'll just try them on to see how the outfit is but they're so nice because they're like silk so I think I'm gonna have to get them because there's no other option and then these two are trying stuff on as well this is the only thing I've tried on but these lot I've tried like 10 things on each this is, no I've only tried two tops on I'm only getting this top and I'm not getting these trousers because too much. And Alina? And his top's eight quid, so... Oh my god. It's half price. Look at I need to get more kurte. I just didn't really look properly. Yeah, you so. should look. Is it, Guys, is I can't get over this. this. Yeah. I feel so, so like... Oh, really? Um, it's flowy. Yeah? I was gonna change. Oops. <laughs> We're just coming to Hardy's for a snack because we've just done some shopping in Cardi. So our snack is just some loaded fries and some drinks. Oh, you're gonna love these. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm a mouth watering, so I'm gonna turn this off now. <laughs> so we just wiped those clean. Put a fork in us. <laughs> I think we're going home now. Are you ready, Alana? Yeah. It's day two. It feels like day 20, not gonna lie. My skin's breaking out so much. Like, I don't know what's happened. Like, I don't know where these spots have come from. My cousin's son, Musa, missed Alina. So he's come running to see her because he was asleep while we were there. Oh, he's so cute, he's matching. Oh, look at his shoes. <laughs> oh, okay. Millie Alina, so. Oh. Oh. We are going to a salon now. Basically, we had planned to get a lot of things done, but um, it's already thought that. No, no, I mean at the salon, like we were gonna get one of everything. <laughs> we might still like. We're gonna have to see what there is in it. I don't want to get like anything on my face, but makeup. Yeah, I don't yeah, want to yeah, get any like facials done because no. um, I break out if I use a towel that anyone else has used or anything so definitely not doing anything to my face I like to do my eyebrows myself so I'm not gonna let them do that either but I was thinking about getting a haircut from here but I don't know the sitch oh guys look this guy's run out of petrol so what's he doing oh, he's no. trying to turn it so like, the petrol oh, oh so that's really sound why didn't he fill up <laughs> Oh my, god. So, it was a oh my god, it was a police <laughs> So we're gonna go there. The salon's called Alenura. We'll let you we'll do a quick review of the services. <laughs> they're not used, Alina, they're washed. They're just not dried. So our pizza's here. This one was the chicken fajita, I think. Sicilian. Sicilian. We're just about to eat um, pizza hot. <laughs> she has to snap everything to her mum and then that's just the veggie one. So Alina did a really good roundup for her mum so I'm gonna let her do it let her do it again for that the vlog. The deadest pizza of her life. Explain. It had no tomato sauce. That's it. That was it. But like what's pizza without it's cheese and tomato and if there's no tomato, what the hell is it? It did have tomato sauce. Like no, like 0 0.1 millimeters spread across the whole pizza. <laughs> it's quite late now 
and uh, we decided to do some shopping and um, we went to one shop for Alina and Ramesh's clothes, Ramesh's her sister. Um, did you like any? Like I liked a few things but I want to love them. Oh yeah, she didn't like fall in love with anything. Except so. you did fall in love with that. Uh, yeah, I fell in love with one that was really nice. Like I actually loved it. Yeah, it was but really. It nice. was velvet, and it's a summer wedding. So she decided not to get it. Yeah. And then when she decided not to get it, I decided to get it for any future weddings that just happened to pop up. Yeah. So yeah. I will be getting that and now we're on our way to um oh my god I was gonna tell you what shop it is but I'm not allowed to say Why? uh because my badgie wants to keep it a secret well we're going to check up on badgie's um Velima bridal outfit exciting and that's in first about too why do I look so round me too like I look like a moon like the moon emoji is me <laughs> you don't have a wide face my mum says I do oh, not very nice <laughs> So it's time to do some snack shopping, our favourite kind of shopping. We're also going to get sugar free bread here because all bread here is sweet. It's like half flour, half sugar, so we're going to get sugar free bread. Our oh, noodles, ideal. Oh my god, I used to love them. What's that? Spicy. Yeah. Oh my god. Yum. I love patisa. Wait, is it okay from here? Ask Ahmed bye. <laughs> He's gonna ask for us. Alina's in her element. She had some biscuits last night and she's on the hunt for them. <laughs> but she found them eventually. <laughs> Yummerish. Yeah, Why? Who has masala flavor? That'll be beautiful. Um, kurkure are really nice. <laughs> what did you just call it? <laughs> They're called kurkure. <laughs> I don't know if it was the red one or the green one, but one of them's a lot nicer than the other. And there's oi hoi as well. Oh wow! Which is another brand. They have a really cool branding. So oh, I think these are nice. Oh my god, slantia. What Did you see that? the difference? Vegetable. No, they're not nice. Really? It's the other flavours that are nice. Jalapeno. Mmm, yummy. Like Chicken right. chilli wow, flavour. Wow, we're getting that. Okay, yeah. We need a basket. They don't have baskets here. Drive your challenge, Shama. Please show the cake. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you. We're in another bakery now. Oh no, it's not a bakery, it's just a shop. Oh my god, Alina, if you try these, these? you will visit heaven. And <laughs> 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 okay, so here's what we got. Sugar-free bread, fruit cake, patisa, which is yummers. A variety of biscuits for Alina. These were her favourite ones, so she made sure to get a lot of these. Five noodles. Can someone quickly count how many crisps we got? I think there's basically 14. All of this cost a whopping six pound. Six English pounds. That was 1,060 rupees. Let that just sink in. Six pound. Guys, I don't think I've ever told you how good this chef's food is, but my dad's just found someone who can just make everything and it tastes so good. Can you guys see those aloo? And can you imagine how tasty they are? I don't think you can. Okay, whatever you imagine, times it by 10. <laughs> Thank you, Badju. So this morning, Alina asked for roti with batone. No, yesterday. Oh, yesterday. And um, he didn't have any at home. And then today he made the butter himself. Made it himself, like how. My sister's had some and she said it's like a taste party in her mouth. <laughs> okay, so we realised we didn't review the leg. <laughs> the treatment. The treatment. Uh, Ali Nura. Uh, okay, let's go out of ten each. Okay, so I got 
wax, leg wax, arm wax, and underarm wax. Um, and I got a body scrub. The scrub, I thought it could have been longer. Also, only brides get that done, so I thought it should have been a more look, Alina, more luxurious thing. <laughs> it was kind of like shit. Like she shouldn't. I wanted to tell her to change the towel where I put my head. You had a towel. Where you put your head. <laughs> I didn't. Basically, right. we've just oh discovered that Alina's, oh Alina's lady didn't really do Wait. things very professionally. <laughs> Let me tell you. So, I got everything the same as asthma. We had the scrub first. Basically, do you know what the scrub was on where you lay on like a massage table and they didn't cover that with like any tissue paper or ta anything. Like, I didn't have any towels. Like, this was a full body scrub, right? Just bear that in mind. So, I'm just on the table. We all had to get on the table with no towel on there. And it was like creamy. It's like, uh, why didn't they like wipe it down with like antibacterial? No, your ta my table wasn't creamy. My table wasn't creamy. My, mine, was creamy. mine was creamy because my sister had just been on it. So, uh. um, everything that they're saying they had, like towels, <laughs> I didn't have. <laughs> when so you guys came out, did she give you a little thing to put on when you came out after changing your coat? She told you to. Put your okay, coat we're hijabis on what? this channel, so let's Wait, not talk too explicitly. See, I had that and then I walked to there and then she told me to Walk take that off. To where? to the room because the changing room was somewhere else. So you had a changing room as well? <laughs> <laughs> what did you have? I had to get changed in the same room. She took me into the room. She was take your clothes off <laughs> and she left. We had a changing room. What the hell? And then she was like, be right back, I'll get you a sheet. So then I was, I had the sheet. Okay, and then so I you the had sheet. a changing room and a sheet and towels. I had none of those things. And a shower. We had a shower yeah, as well. Yeah, I had the scrub. We had a shower. My lady took my scrub off with wet towels. <laughs> she didn't give me the But I would have preferred <laughs> that because the shower was a bit... Yeah, there was wee in the yeah, toilet yeah, yeah. and the person like, that flushed the toilet. The, the body scrub was a bit of a mixed experience. And the wax is very interesting because... Um, Basically, yeah. she had two types of wax. She had normal wax and she had something called fruit wax. And then she put both on one on one leg and one on the other. And she was like, look, which one's look which one's better? The fruit wax took more. It worked better. So I was like, okay, I'll go for that. She's like, it's extra though. So I was like, that's fine because it's like <laughs> Pakistani. It's not going to be that much. Anyway, she applied all of the wax with a butter knife. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know how you have like the wooden sticks? She had a butter knife. <laughs> and can we just sure, see? Sure. <laughs> Can you see the basically the, wounds. the scratches from the butter knife here? Like I've got skin coming off. You should have told her that you shouldn't use a knife to do that. Sorry about the quality change, guys. My camera just died. The waxing was fine. It's just that it was applied with a butter knife, and I actually got a what's a sheet thing this time. So this girl actually gave me the the things I was supposed to have to cover up and stuff. And my lady, <laughs> like all of them. Were, okay, so just in general, all of the staff there looked like they didn't really want to be there or do any of the things. <laughs> The whole time I was getting waxed, she was giving me like her sob story about how much she has to work, how little she gets paid, and how I, uh, which 100% I, I agree, like I'm very lucky that my parents went abroad and all of that stuff, but like, like I'm just there to get a wax. Like, <laughs> basically she wanted me to give her a tip, and I would have if I had any money on me, but I had our money. She was just like saying oh like bridal season is better because like, i can make more money i was like oh okay so did the, bri did the brides pay you extra and stuff she was like no you're not understanding i was like okay like but i had understood by then that what she meant was bridal season is better because the brides give her tips and stuff but like i don't know like it's weird when people ask for tips like if i'm yeah. happy with the service i'll give you the tip but anyway also there were signs everywhere <laughs> don't give tips <laughs> i think this should be the end of the vlog Oh, okay. We'll catch you guys. Uh, Do you think? In, yeah. So, in conclusion, the best salon in this city is not great. I wouldn't go back. It's so like, basically, far. I wouldn't go back. Like, like, all the decor was really nice. Like, it looked nice and stuff. But the staff was shit. And the service was shit. And I didn't get a towel. It's not like... And Alina, the scrub wasn't that cheap. How much was it? 4,000. Okay, so the scrub was 24 quid. Whoa. Right. So, that means we only paid 6 quid for waxing. <laughs> That's really expensive. So if we didn't get that, I'd just have paid six quid, which I would, would have been happy with because I hated my experience of the body score. I just wanted it to be over. I saw a woman <laughs> sleeping, right? She's 
she sweeped everything, made it in a pile, and then moved like. Say you're getting your um, hair cut and you put your rest your foot on like say like a yeah, slab. Yeah, yeah. She picked up that slab and moved everything. <laughs> up behind her, put the slab. Was it the lady oh. in Chilbert? Yes. <laughs> I didn't think my scrub thing was clean. Like we all felt the urge to shower as soon as we got out of the Except salon. Except I wasn't given the option, the option to shower. No, like even after that shower, I wanted to come home and shower. Like, we all, like a proper we shower. all got it's hot. Like Badgie, got could you work the top shower head? <laughs> 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 I was like here, yeah. and then like I put my body here. Like, yeah, that's what I was doing. I was like, I hope I don't fall because this shower is disgusting. <laughs> And yeah, oh my god, when we were at the reception, we were like, we want this body scrub thing, which was what we read off the service menu, treatment menu. And she was like, um, okay, well, if you're gonna get that, then you have to get the polish as well. We or, like, you know, you should get the polish as well. Oh, we were like, oh, right, okay. Um, where's the polish then? <laughs> no, we, we looked for it for a bit and we were like, where's the polish? And she was like, what did she say? It's not on here, but. And we were like, okay, so what is a polish? And she was just like, no, but like an exfoliator is a polish. What's a polish? The, do you know when I was getting mine done? She sh she was like, you should have got a polish too, and I was like, yeah. What? The wax lady said to me, you should have got a polish. And too. I was like, what's a polish? But she couldn't understand me. <laughs> <laughs> and then she was just like, huh. <laughs> Also, they both opted for the fruit wax and Alina had to pay more and Badgie's <laughs> woman had got her back so Badgie didn't have to pay. Basically, but that's because she, she wanted, wanted the tip. She wanted the money, she wanted the tip off her. Alright then, see you guys in my next one. Bye! We're going first of all to pick up my bridal. <gasps> that's the most exciting thing. This is the best ice thing in the world. This is the best ice thing in the world. This is the best ice thing in the world. This is the best ice thing in the world. So why do you buy it? You give them business, so they do it like this. Please do another job. This is such a bad thing. Why do you so cute? I haven't hugged Badgie this whole trip because she's been doing my head in. I'm going to have a walk by. It was you! 